Good morning, 8.30, Saturday, looking at space weather. What we have here, we have another X-Class just left the sun, maybe 20 minutes ago, some, somewhere in there. So we got another one on the way. Now, looking at spaceweather.com, it's not over, storm is not over. We had auroras seen all the way down in Florida, in the Florida Keys. Now we have a credible report of auroras in Puerto Rico. Okay, damn. Mm. Well, that tells me our strength, our shields are weaker than, than I thought if it's reach. Let's see. Let's check out what's happening right now. Okay, right now they have it at currently at a G3. So that means, wow, look at this right here. Those are protons electrically charged. And the, okay, this year, June 2nd, uh, a lot of people, since I follow the comet on June 2nd, when the comet gets closest to Earth, these two planets, Jupiter and Venus, and there are uh, five others, I think the sun and the moon, and they get together in the constellation Taurus, you know, following the comet tell stories. That's the way I read them. I read their stories. Okay, the threshold is it's up. It's still a nine. This is esto es malo. This is radiation. In other words, we're getting dosed. Okay, here it is right now. It looks like an X2. It looks like an X2. I'm not sure. It's still update. They'll update it. But let's take a look what's happening now. Okay, we're not getting hit. Remember, we still got what? We had three waves. We got three waves on the on the way. So if it reach all the way, let's say that story is true about Puerto Rico. But we know Florida, Southern Florida is confirmed. Florida Keys, the Auroras. So right now, this is what we have, the daytime sites, which is right us in the United States. Anybody that's seen this in the daytime, let's see the, the latest. The latest would be right here where my pointer's at. Okay, eased up a little bit. I'll freeze it right now. Okay, right there, right now. Okay, that's that's right now. And our shields are taking a beat in the Milagro que is still up. You got the North Pole and the South Pole charged up like a like a Christmas light. I mean, we got cracks. There's radiation coming in. Of course, they're going to say there's nothing to worry here like that. Um, yeah, they'll say there's nothing nothing to see here. Yeah, they'll say nothing, nothing to see here. Everything's just fine. Everything is just just fine. <laughs> No, but seriously, I'm surprised that people are not talking about the biological effect. This is radiation. So many, this affects the DNA. It's already studies on it. Just Google, Google it. And you see the studies on solar radiation damage to the DNA. A lot of studies. I had one study that I was reading the government and then I got the, the computer froze. So no, I just, not again. I got away from it. I just said, I'm not going back there again. They're going to. They're going to knock the old man out. But the studies about the radiation and they used to, like I said, they used to have when it's level five, when it's like this, anybody above in the air, you know, passengers and uh, you know what, they would get like the equivalent of maybe two, three doses of x-rays, I think it was per, per hour, per minute, something like that. I don't remember. They used to have that and they took it away. Now I can't refer to it. Now I can't find it. Anybody out there that knows what I'm talking about, this is affecting the molecules. This is affecting the filament, everything. We got cracks. They're not going to tell you where. All you got to do is look for hot spots around the planet, you know, the water, the, the land, where's, where's the places getting burnt the most or getting the most heat, like the movie, The Core. So there it is. Another X1, number eight on the way. The daytime right now, uh, they're saying it's a G3, but we know, we all know the Riddler, the Riddler, Batman. Always depend on the information the government gives you because they're accurate. Until next time, pray, stay safe, don't fear. What can you do? If it happens, it happens. Just be prepared. If it does happen in a flash without warning, just, just be prepared spiritually, number one. Physically, you're being mutated. You're being changed, hopefully for the better. Maybe being, DNA is getting activated, like my compadre told me. So here's the site. So we got another X class one left the sun a couple minutes ago on its way number eight right now we got a little pop no we don't got no pause just be advised when you go outside you're going to feel more tired you're going to feel strange you're going to have ear ear aches uh ringing of the ear all sorts of physical transformation